All right, welcome back to the final reaction. Nick here. And I wasn't sure I was going to record this just because it's getting later. I got work tomorrow, but obviously I did because you're watching it right now. I just post my reaction for The Flash. Go ahead and check that out uh, on this channel and also our other channel, Born Reviews. But this reaction is going to be strictly here on The Final Reaction, where it belongs here. And I just, I'm so excited for this movie, but I'm also not, I don't want it to come too soon because it is the the last, the final Guardians of the Galaxy film from what we're told. It's the final James Gunn Guardians of the Galaxy film, at least from what we're told. He's going to be very busy at DC and it, I can't imagine it's not going to be good. I was one of the few, it seems, that really liked the second one. So there hasn't been a bad one for me. Holiday Special was fantastic. And now we have the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3. And I got to be honest, like I remember the teaser watching that a few months back or whenever that came out. And I don't remember too much about it. I remember it seemed like a really heavy on Rocket. It seemed like a lot of sad tones. I'm excited for a fuller length trailer though. And that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to react to the Guardians of the Galaxy 3 trailer. And this is a film that I don't know if as many people are excited about it as they were the second one. Because a lot of people did not love the second one. Which again, I, I still like it. Is it a different type of film? Sure. Is, is the villain not great? Sure. Is it drag on? Sure. But I still liked the movie. I love these characters. I love when they showed up in Infinity Wars and Endgame. And so we also got to get some closure on uh, the Gamora situation, right? And so let's go ahead. I'm going to check this out. Please do me a huge favor here in the final reaction. We're trying to grow this channel. It's taking a little bit of time, but that's okay. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help out. This channel helps us grow. Let's me know if you like what I'm doing here. And if even if you don't like what I'm doing, let's me know that you uh, enjoy this kind of content, I should say. And, and let me know what your thoughts are. Please let me know what your thoughts are on this new trailer, on this movie coming out. Are you excited? Is it meh? Has uh, Phase 4 just kind of just disappointed you more and more? I'm not hearing the best things about Quantum Media. Not horrible things, but I was hoping for like great things. I love that Ant-Man character. But right now, this is about Guardians of the Galaxy. Let's go step into this world for a few minutes here in this trailer right now. I'm going to tell you something. I'm Star-Lord. Let's play Cosmic Chess. I formed the Guardians. And Groot stacked. Met a girl, fell in love. That girl died. But then she came back. And came she back a total dick. Oh, please. <laughs> He left out some important information, but that is the gist of it. She seems a little more emotional in her face, though. You know you're going to get great music, too. My sacred mission is to create the perfect society. Oh, no. What does that ever work out? I want to make things perfect. He just hated things the way they are. Cool. I want you all to know that I am grateful to fight beside my friends. Incinerate them. Oh. Yeah. Absolutely. We were always searching for a family until we found each the other. Dog is free. Adam Ready? Warlock for one last ride. <laughs> we'll all fly away together into the forever and beautiful sky. was that you were in love with? It sounds more like her. Her? That's Do ridiculous. not bring me into this. Don't even. <laughs> Knock it off! What? <laughs> you never noticed how black your eyes were. They were replaced by my father as a method of torture. He he picked a pretty set. Nope. <laughs> nope. I thought I was assuming it was coming out May 5th, but I didn't even know the I don't pay attention to release dates, obviously, from teasers for crying out loud. 
So it, it looks like we're going to get great music. I never even heard that song. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. But still, it was a great song. We're going to get great music. We're going to get great comedy. We're going to get the great ensemble cast. I just, I don't have like that feeling of, oh my goodness, I've got to watch this movie right now. But again, it's like, I want I want to wait on it. I can wait on it because it's going to be the last one we get. I'm going to be there day one. I'm going to be there super excited. I'm going to be there with my popcorn and my snacks and probably my kids. And we're going to be sitting there excited to watch it. But I'm not as hyped as I was like for the Flash, Flash trailer or for other things that are coming out. And it's the kind of same thing with Quantumania. And no, I'm not an MCU hater. Not at all. I'm just a bigger DC guy. But ever since Endgame, besides No Way Home, each MCU film has not been quite that level where it's like, oh my gosh, these guys are amazing. Still really, really good. Really, really good. Most of them. Eternals, stop it. Um... Good to really good, but not fantastic. And so I hope this one is great. Let me know what you think. But the trailer was good. I just I just don't know. Okay, I'm not sure there's enough meat on the bone, so to speak. Excited to see Adam Warlock walk. Excited to see the Gamora and Peter Quill. And I don't even need them to get together. I really don't. But I'm excited to see that dy dynamic. The whole thing with Gamora, that, that was... <laughs> <laughs> that was so stupid. He's such an idiot. But let me know what you think about my reaction here. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. And until next time, adios.